know there's always going to be nuclear weapons. But wouldn't it be nice if there weren't? Ladies and gentlemen, he's the captain of the Denver... But off the court as well. He was the man that suggested to the other NBA All-Stars to donate some of their checks to help the starving in Ethiopia. He was a man who worked in the schools to tell children, to impress upon children the importance of reading and writing. He was an all pro and still is in every sense of the word. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome back home the incomparable Alex English. tonight and salute Alex. One very special person that couldn't be, but watch the diamond visions on each side of the arena. I'm NBA Commissioner David Stern, and I want to add my voice to all those congratulating of his uniform. Alex, you were not only a great player, you were a leader in this league on and off the court. Your leadership of our Players Association in collective bargaining and helping us to formulate professional sports best anti-drug agreement your work now as director of player programs for the players association really set you apart as a leader of yesterday's players today's players and tomorrow's players as well thanks for all that you've done and congratulations tonight on this well-deserved honor For the first presentation of the evening, the Honorable Mayor of Denver, Wellington Webb. Alex, it is with great pleasure as mayor of this city that on behalf of the people of the city and county of Denver that we rename the street that runs next to this arena, Alex English Avenue. And to also declare this as Alex English Day in Denver, Colorado, for not only this city, but for the whole state. I'd like to introduce Mr. John Burke, the Vice President of Spike USA, company that Alex is now involved in. On behalf of his partners at Spike USA, I'd like to present Alex with a uniform for his new career as a businessman. He's sure to lead the way into a successful business career with his new designer suit. Congratulations, Alex, and our very best wishes to you and your family. From the Division of Youth Services from the state of Colorado, I'd like to bring out Lonnie Lynn and Ivan Tate, presenting a plaque in recognition of Alex's appointment to the school's director's advisory committee with deep appreciation. And I'm sure for my teammates, to, uh, at that time of year, it's a, it says that you have accomplished what you set out to accomplish, and that is to make it to the playoffs 
and hopefully get into the NBA championships. You have an NBA record. You have several uh, records, obviously, here in Denver. Eight consecutive seasons of 2,000-plus points. The all-time score in the 80s. Are those the most precious uh, records for you? Those are special, special records, but... Second round pick by the Milwaukee Fox. And, of course, uh, he didn't stay there very long. Ended up in Denver short time after. And uh, the crowd on its feet as Alex English's jersey a moment ago was raised to the roof. And I imagine that Alex will show his appreciation now. First times in my life that I've been speechless. I must say that I am very grateful to all of you all for showing me that you did appreciate what I did here in Denver, Colorado. I enjoyed every minute of it just as much as you all did. And it's one of those things that you just put in your memory and you put in your trophy case and you hold it and you look back on it years past and say, hey, did I really do this? And was I really a part of this? They say behind every successful man there's a good woman. I've had a good woman behind me every step of the way. She has been my ally in my moments of adversity, in my moments of success, in my moments of happiness. She has been my ally, my wife, Vanessa, and my... And to be able to stand here and share this moment with my children is probably the most fantastic thing of all because this tells them that dad did play basketball one time. <laughs> yeah. There was no way in my life that I could close the chapter of my basketball playing days without being able to come back to Denver, Colorado and thank all the many, many fans that have been my supporters and to get the justice that I'm being given by the Denver Nuggets, the new Denver Nugget organization tonight. I thank them very much. There's a lot of my friends here, and I wish that I could name them all, but uh, it would take me all night to name 19,000 names. But there are, there are a few that I would just like to see if I can remember their names, because they have been special. Miss Clotilde Rossborough, we called her Miss Russ. Mark and Sarah Pendleton. Jan and Glenn Schaffron, Schaffron. Uh, my teammates over the years, Mike Evans, Dan Issel, Calvin Nett, who was my enforcer, T.R. Dunn, Bill Hanslick, Alan Bristow, Doug Moe, all of them were my friends. The Rockies, Gerald Clark, Alex Cole, and Brawley 